Hello internet video viewing world and welcome to another Extreme PC Reviews box opening video and today we are opening the Raid Max Blade, a new computer case from Raid Max and on the front of the box we just have the Blade and Raid Max and their website and on the side of the box we have the specifications. There are four five and a quarter inch drive bays and one three and a half inch external drive bay and on the inside there are four three and a half inch drive bays for hard drives whatever and it's fits a standard 10 by 12 max size uh, ATX form factor motherboard or micro ATX motherboard and there are the standard seven expansion slots and the IO ports are two USB 2.0 and two audio ports and the dimensions are uh, 20 and a quarter by 7 and a quarter by 17 inches and let's open this box up and see what we get on the inside and at the top and the bottom of the case there's some foam and some cardboard and some more foam up here and down here in the middle to secure it and it is encased in a plastic bag and let's free up this case and take a closer look at it all right, now that we have the case out of the packaging, we see up front we have four five and a quarter inch drive bays. We have a power and power LED. We have a reset and hard drive activity LED. We have one three and a half inch drive bay. We have two USBs. We have a microphone or headphone and microphone jack. And down here we have some cool looking grill for intake of the 120 millimeter fan. And on the other side of that also we have some ventilation and on the side we have a blue window and a spot for a optional one 20 millimeter fan. And on the back we have one 20 millimeter fan or you can put an optional 90 millimeter fan and we have the IO shield plate goes here and seven ventilated expansion slots. More ventilation over here with two grommeted holes for uh, water tubing or wires or fingers to pass through. And on the bottom we have a bottom on a power supply with a filter, removable filter. And on the side and on the top there is no ventilation. And four thumb screws to on each side. Let's remove these and take a look at the inside. And with this case, we get a couple of screws, some washers, some uh, motherboard standoffs, and a motherboard speaker. And get all the wires. And let's get a close up here. We have a cutout for the retention plate on a CPU cooler. And some cable management holes in here. And with a couple of little, oh, some standoffs already installed on the motherboard tray, which is cool. And some knockouts here for attaching cables to. And the four uh, five and a quarter inch drive bay and the four internal three and a half inch drive bay are toolless. You just turn, pull off, put the drive in, attach these, put these on, and the seven expansion slots on the back are not toolless. They're screws, which I almost prefer to have screws back here. That way you know that it's secure. And close look at the bottom. And there you have it, the box opening of the Raid Max Blade. Thank you for watching and have a great day.
can't sing for you. I can't.